you're new and today I just wanted to show you what I'm gonna be doing today and it's actually gonna be the start of my birthday vlog my birthday is in two days so today I decided to just color my hair just because I haven't been to the hair salon so long it is very long so before I head out I actually wanted to show you my outfit so I'm just wearing simple leggings and then a off-the-shoulder tank and then I just threw on a coat because I will be staying out late This is my hair. Oh, I really like it. Although it's a little bit too short for my liking, it's really cute. I got myself some bubble tea. But overall, really like it. I got a gray balayage. And it's so nice. Although there's a little bit purple in a little bit purple in there just because we we did use purple shampoo. And what was great about it is they actually put protein in my hair. So it's a lot healthier than what it would bleach since I did bleach it for a few hours. So we are actually on our way to Queens because I'm going to get some dinner with some co-workers in Jersey. So just getting driven like the princess I am. Yeah, so I'm going to be getting dinner. I'll probably show you guys the view of it because we, we booked a reservation for a seafood place by the riverfront, which is really nice. So hopefully with outdoor dining, we need to take all precautions as possible. So yeah, I'll see you guys. So the color in my hair still looks the same. I did wash a little bit and a little color faded, but I still think it's holding its color and it looks amazing. And I just curled it because I think um, a balayage looks a lot better with curled hair. So I'm about to head out because I'm going to the edge just to see the new touristy spot. It is by Hudson Yard, so it's a little bit, it's a building where it does have like an hour portion that you can like look down and it's all glass. So I'm excited to see that. I am afraid of heights, so I'm gonna see how that goes, but I'm excited to see it. It's gonna be a little bit chilly outside, so I just wanna show you guys what I'm going to wear. It's, I'm inside I'm wearing a white and navy striped shirt. And it is off the shoulder, but I'm not gonna be just I'm gonna keep this layer on. So on top of it, I'm just wearing my quilted jacket, very warm, perfect for fall. And it's just I love these, I love the go details on it. It is from J. Crew, bought it like a couple of years ago and for pants, just simple leggings, and for shoes, I'm gonna be wearing some white sneakers. I'll insert photos of when I take photos of edge, so yeah. I'm not gonna lie, this is actually really creepy. I'm a little bit scared, but it's an experience. I don't even know if it's, it's like a museum. Oh. It's, it's, it's like a museum. Like. Oh, wow. <laughs> we need to do the apple picking farm and another 
a bunch of Fiji apples right here. I can really free because I do love Fiji apples. Fiji apples are the favorite. Can you show me? thousand years left. Hey guys, so I just want to pop into the vlog video just to show you what I got for my birthday. It's actually been a week after I've been busy with work so I've been unable to do this. Um, updates on my hair, I've been washing it pretty frequently so the color has been fading. It's still a little bit hint of gray in it but you can definitely see the brassiness coming through. And I'm very thankful that even during this pandemic, my friends and my family were still able to gift me some items for my birthday. As you can see, I didn't really do much. We were very safe, practiced social distancing, and I haven't really been doing much except for work. And the reason why there was such like a, like a week and a half between my vlog and now is because I've just been really busy with work and stuff. So the first thing I want to show you what I got is actually from... Lululemon and I didn't know that my previous haul I did buy some items so my friend was very kind enough to get me another pair so these are just a simple pair of Lululemon leggings it's the wonder under the different fabric than the online ones that I bought previously and to go with he just bought me a simple workout tank and very simple and actually I got this one hand that was much longer but I prefer my tops to be just a little bit cropped and then it's such a big surprise that my best friend actually got me an item. She got me the Supreme the Simple Book Bag because I have been looking for a simple black book bag for a very long time just to replace my current one for traveling purposes. So I was actually very surprised that she was able to get one for me through the website because I know that with Supreme items are very hard to get. So thank you for that. And then. My sister actually got me several, she got me two pairs of shoes and the first pair is actually from Everly. And so I have been looking for like the perfect booty since my perfect booties were destroyed after wearing them for so many years I had to throw them out. So my perfect black booties, especially since fall and winter is coming up, I wear them every day. They just go with everything. So my perfect booty is a two inch block heel with a very pointed toe and it's ankle length. And for some reason, it's been really hard for me to find one that's two inches. A lot of them are just like more than two inches or less. So she was able to get a pair for me. It's beautiful, a very pointed toe, and a two inch block here. Yeah. So and it comes just with a zipper, and I just cannot wait to wear those. They look amazing. So me and my sister, we usually get each other a very um, a gift for each of our birthdays. And this year, she actually got me a pair of Gucci loafers. Ooh, I'm actually very excited for this. I have been wanting a pair. I have one pair of loafers, but they're from Aldo, so they weren't the Gucci ones. And as much as I really wanted the Gucci ones, I didn't want to spend the money on it because I thought just a pair of shoes, it's nothing really special. But very thankful that she was able to get me these shoes. It came in like these bags, one for each shoe. Actually, the Gucci shoes. They're very simple, just loafers, and very, they're, they're so nice. Because although they are a bit pricier, they are surprisingly very comfortable. And these are the ones that you can actually step on it to kind of like, because I don't want to crease it because they're new. But you can crease on it to kind of make um, like a slide version of these. So thank you so much to my sister because it's a beautiful. And then I actually treated myself to a pair of shoes. So... <laughs> It's actually the same thing as the Gucci ones, but these are the meals instead. They don't have a back to it. The one that I had broke, so I was just wanted to replace it, especially since fall is here, and I, I love wearing these. These are just a staple in fall, so I'm so thankful that I was able to purchase these. Oh, yeah. I was able to get my first Chanel piece, which I'm very excited for. And it's just, it's really, it's amazing. This is the flat card holder and it's in caviar and it's just in the gold. 
so it's very beautiful and as you can see you can you can kind of see the pebble leather since it's caviar and this is the updated version with the pocket on behind it usually they don't have it so inside is just one card slot over here and then inside is just where you can put like cash or and more cards you have and, and so ah, so excited to use this so there you go and then I also got this candle. So this candle means so much to me. This is from one of my favorite Korean dramas, Crash Landing on Netflix. I probably watched that drama too many times. <laughs> A little bit too much, actually. So this is, it's not the exact candle, but it's the same brand and smell. So it's the Lily candle. I can't really describe the smell, but <laughs> I'm very bad at describing things. Therefore, so for this one, it's the candle that Ri Jong Yook uses to find unity in the marketplace in North Korea. And it just, I didn't expect her to get this from me, especially since you have to ship it from Korea. So, and I'll actually link it down below so you guys can, if you guys are Crash Landing fans like I am, you guys can definitely have it. So I actually used it today and it just, it's my fangirling moment because it's Crash Landing. Um, and then on top of that, um, she made me a card and it just I'm not gonna read what's inside but she actually drew this on on her iPad and it's just so beautiful so we are actually both really obsessed with friends I watched that show so many times when it wasn't on Netflix anymore I, I was very sad so we actually went to the 25th anniversary pop-up pop-up for friends and they have like sections of each of the infamous scenes in Friends and one of the infamous scenes is when they had a turkey on their head and they walked in where, where Hanukkah had a turkey on top of her head to try to cheer up Chandler because Chandler was mad at her or something and we actually did this and she actually drew the exact photo on there so I'll insert a photo of what the image actually looks like so very thankful for this and Again, that's all I got for my birthday this year. Again, I'm very thankful that in this pandemic I'm able to like I'm able to receive all these gifts. I'm thankful for each and every single one of my friends and family who were able to get me these gifts. So yes. That's it. Thanks for watching. Bye. It's the flat car. And